What is that? That's gotta be a muskie. I got him! Sign him, it's musky! Oh. 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 Big fish! Oh. It's a big fish! Oh! I got a big one! Not that big, but it's a good fish. Got him, yeah. Oh, I thought it was a bigger fish than that, but oh, that's a good one. Crush the Medusa. I don't think I'm gonna have any of that on footage. I all of a sudden was fishing this little island here with some rocks and uh, I was watching my side imaging and I saw a weird mark off out in the deep water. I cast it out and Capachi and I scored on the old Medusa here. Awesome fish, oh, oh yes. All right, let's get her unhooked. She's hooked high in the net. Well guys, I just got out here. Didn't even do it an intro, but Welcome back to Slime and Slay Outdoors here. We are out on the water, and I just caught a nice muskie here. Um, probably low 40s, maybe a 40 to 41 inch, I'm guessing. Um, just a chunky one, so it's kind of hard to judge, but um, I know I marked that fish on side imaging, which is awesome. I, I've been starting to play more and more with it, and uh, on, I was actually running the boat, or the trolling motor in the back of the boat, watching it as my map feature, and I saw this weird mark out in the depths. So I cast it and turned around and cast it, and kabam, my rod, lo rod loaded up. I thought it was way bigger than that. I was yelling, big fish, big fish, but it was pulling down hard, and, and uh, I mean, it's definitely a nice northern Wisconsin muskie, so let's get it held up, and I guess, welcome back to another episode. All right, guys. Got the bump board here, dip her in the water. It's always good to dip your bump board in prior to lifting them up. Just got out here, it's just at, just about 5.45 now. Wet the glove down, and uh, let's get a look at this fish. I don't think she's, I don't think she's as big as I thought. I think she's just chunkier. Let's get a look. Alrighty, there she is folks. Nice, healthy Wisconsin muskie right there. All right, let's get a measurement quick. And she is 39 and a half. What a beast, 39 and a half right there. All right, let's let her go. <laughs> I was gonna try to grab the camera and she was gone. She wanted no part of me. Slime old stash, baby, yeah, that is awesome. Just got out here and we scored on about, I don't know, 20th cast, or not even 20th. I mean like the fifth, uh, sixth cast, something like that on good old rubber. This guy's been hot so far for me this year. The hot tail walleye color. That's a great one here for Northern Wisconsin. So, alrighty, let's keep her going. Hopefully we can get another one here tonight. What a chunky fish though.
I got him. Wow, hit it. Decent fish. Yeah, decent fish. Skinny fish. Second one on the Medusa tonight. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let him just fight it out. Oh yeah. Oh, he's hooked good. All right, get the net. Oh yes. Yes. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. That lure is hot tonight, baby. That's another long but skinny fish. Very long. Well, I mean, not long, long, but uh, long but skinny. On the Medusa, again. Fish number two tonight. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, man, that hit hard, actually, though. He hit it right when I was just about to jerk down again, ripping that Medusa here against the shoreline. He pounded it. Hardy. Let's get him unhooked. Well, guys, just got that fish unhooked. Had to use the old hook cutters, Boga grip. Just wanted to show, cut that back hook right there. Whenever a bad situation like that, just cut him. Look how nice and easy he's in the net. Let's just let him rest a little bit. Get the bump board out, grab a glove. We'll take a photo and he'll be good to go. That's the best thing about um, hooks. They're cheap. It's easier just to cut them and to save a fish like that so you can catch him again. Alrighty, let's hold him up. Alrighty guys, awesome little night here. Move the camera just down a bit. There we go, that should be good. Got the old release glove. Bump board again, it's already wet. From earlier. And uh, let's hold this guy up and get a little look-sees at him. All right. Oh man, this has been a blast. They're, they fight hard when you hit them on rubber. Rubber is the ticket tonight. There he is. Oh, what a fish. Beautiful. Wisconsin muskie right there. Oh yeah. Get a little picture. All right. Put him on the bump board. Oh, hang on buddy. 40 and a half. He's 40 and a half right there. All right. Let's let this girl go back. Oh yeah. Oh, dang it. <laughs> they are angry tonight. I can't even get them to grab them. And they're off just like that. That deserves slime. Oh, stash, baby. Number two. Awesome. Sun is just going down below the tree line. And we scored here at 7.30. First one was at roughly 5.30. So it's been about two hours. And uh, just been keep going with the Medusa. It seems like that's the hot ticket here. I might have to change hook or... Might be going to top quarter here pretty soon, so shouldn't be a big deal, but uh, it's been the hot ticket, so <sighs> I'm shooken up. Let's go, baby.
Here he comes. Here he comes. Hmm. Never, I could never see him. It's getting so dark right now, but uh, definitely was a foul. That was for sure. Waked up on the top water. Didn't see anything though. Huh. It's so hard though. I mean, it's not a lot of daylight left right now. So it's hard to, hard to see down in the water. I got my sunglasses off and everything, but uh, definitely had something wake up. Hopefully the camera can show that, but uh, yeah, it's just about getting ready to hang it up here. And one waked up on the old top water, on the old Dr. Evil. But um, no go. It didn't show a big wave, but it didn't mean that it wasn't a nice fish not right up against the bait or something like that so but uh we'll take it well guys that's gonna wrap it up here um what a heck of a night here it was um rubber was the ticket tonight that's for sure two beautiful northern wisconsin muskies on the medusa and saw one other one here just a few minutes ago and uh yeah, I guess uh, some of the keys that I was working tonight was it seemed like they were really positioned on the drops and steeper drops here tonight. And uh, so we worked a lot of tips off uh, points and uh, anything that hung out from a shoreline, just a nice sharp drop off. It didn't have really much structure other than some rocks and stuff to it, but uh, that was what I noticed tonight being the ticket you working the Medusa. So um, I think the fish are starting to stage up, getting ready to go shallow here for the September bite. But uh, they're right now on the deep, sharp drop-offs, coming out maybe from the open water and stuff like that, and positioning themselves there to ambush any type of predator. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, another big thing tonight was the side imaging. Um, I couldn't believe that I... Comment down below again if that was a fish that I was marking. Uh, I think I had two different ones that I showed, but the one that I caught, I uh, I think you'll be able to hear me say that I think that's a fish and I cast it and within a few pumps I had one. So um, that was very cool. Um, for one side imaging, um, basically caught me a muskie here tonight because I would have never cast it on the other side of the boat kind of away from the structure. So big big thing there with the hummingbird units there to kind of help me get a fish but uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button thanks again for watching and we'll see you on the next adventure